Hey, what's going on guys? This is Mr. Bunny here. I'm here with a free-for-all on the interchange map, and I'm not on Xbox Live today, something a little bit different. I'm actually on PSN, playing on my PlayStation. Uh, I just started a new Mr. Bunny account because I'd never had one on PlayStation. I was use I used to use a different uh, gamer tag on PSN. Um, but I gotta be honest with you, I was hoping to see uh, how good the competition was on PlayStation Network, and I gotta be honest. <laughs> Uh, the competition is just not there. I'd like to think of myself as a decent player all around. I'm not a fantastic player, but just coming into games on the PSN, it just makes me feel like I'm some kind of MLG pro or something because pretty much every game that I've played so far has gone similar to this one. My KD is pretty much off the charts, and people just seem like they really suck and I wasn't pulling host or anything like that it wasn't a connection issue everybody in the lobby had four bars at all times it's just that man I just think the quality of player is just not there on the PlayStation Network and that's not true for all the players on PSN on my other account I have some friends that are actually really good at this game or um, Call of Duty or first-person shooter games but um, I'll be honest I don't see any of that right now as I play. So it's a little disappointing. I was hoping to have a little bit more exciting gameplay, but all it is is basically me tearing through everybody else. And I guess maybe I'll look at it as if I'm not doing good on Xbox Live, then I'll slap <laughs> slap in my Modern Warfare 3 on PlayStation and I'll just instantly feel better about myself apparently because this is just how bad it is for the as far as competition goes. This gameplay is pretty much similar to most of my other free-for-alls that you've seen. I'm just a really aggressive player. I really like the M4 Silence. It seems to be very beast if you put impact on it as your, um, what is that called? Ah, I forget what it's called, but you know, when you can either choose kick or impact. Proficiency, that's what it is. If you use that, even with the silencer, this gun is pretty much a beast. It has an excellent rate of fire. I do wish that the standard issue magazine would be a little bit larger, but that's what you have extended mags for. So, but then you're not going to be able to use your impact. So, it's a give and take. This map is awesome because it's easy to predict the spawn points. And um, I think if you're doing a 1v1 or something on this map, it'd probably be, it'd probably be pretty good for spawn trapping. This guy, what a loser, man. I mean, come on. I'm getting pissed off watching this just because of how suck everybody is. I mean, come on, look at these guys. How suck can you be? What? Oh my, oh my god. What a loser. What a freaking loser. And I pick up, the, okay, this P, P90 is actually a pretty awesome gun. I think this guy has extended, no, not extended mags. It's got silencer and something else on it. And it's a pretty beast gun. I'm going to have to try it out more. I never actually used it, even back in Modern Warfare 2. But I just run through these guys like nothing. Get my attack chopper. That's pretty much all I was trying to go for because once you get attack chopper in this game, it's just beast. It's not like the attack chopper in Modern Warfare 2 where it would just run around in the air and make noise. This attack chopper actually does a little bit of work and I spun on that motherfucker. Got my UAV. Boom, boom. Ah, well, it had to end at some time. Call in my chopper. It's a good place of any to call in my predator. And. At least I get kills with my Predator, I didn't fail, <laughs> so I should be thankful for that. Call in my UAV, make sure I know where I'm going to be heading. And this is another excellent spawn trap right there, or it's not really a spawn trap, it's just a spawn kill. I noticed too that if you're using kill streaks like Reaper, and you try and spawn kill people, it just doesn't work so effectively. Like you can pretty much land a Reaper close to their freaking head and it's not going to kill them, you just get a hit marker. I think it's something that they put into the game so that people just wouldn't get all pissed off and rage quit after getting spawn killed over and over again. And how's this? This guy is such a puss. And right here too, it's like I'm gonna clean this guy out and no, my chopper doesn't work unfortunately. So that chopper, I'm gonna have to think about calling that in if I'm getting close to the end of my free for alls now because I'm getting kind of tired of it taking the game winning kill from me. But anyways. Uh, this is the end of this game. Well, I also want to show you a little clip on a different TDM that I got earlier that um, proves to you that it's just the quality or lack of quality of the players 
on PSN. Look at this guy. Look, what the hell, man? I'm getting mad. If they were on my team, oh my goodness, I'll get pissed. And did I don't know what that guy was doing. And look, I, I mean, come on. I already got a predator. I'm, I'm using hardline, but I already got a predator. Come on. I gotta say, it's probably partially the gun, not really just my skill, or because this gun is beast. I love it. And there's my attack to chopper already. It's just too simple. It's too simple. And this guy doesn't know what the hell is going on. So I pick up this gun, and I've never used this type of reticle before, this optic, and I'm and I'm just still killing it, no problem. <sighs> it's sad. It's sad. I think uh, these PSN players gotta go to Xbox and learn some skills. Anyways, thanks guys. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And uh, hope you enjoyed this commentary. Peace.